That was the low classics. My name is Kay Murdoch. I'm getting ready to bring out the man of the hour, too sweet to be sour, and all those other cool cliches. But give it up one more time for the low classics. They're gonna be backing us tonight. This is special, this is unprecedented. Never done this before. You guys ready to rock? Okay. Without any further ado, I wanna bring out right now teacher, rapper, hero, my man. His name is Random, but we more commonly know him as Mega Ram! The ruler's back! Seattle! Let's have some fun. Yeah, 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 yeah. I hear him talking, see him staring at me. I am who I am, I'll be what I be. And if that don't please you, I'm cool with that. Somebody out there say the ruler's back. I hear him talking, see him staring at me. I am who I am, I'll be what I be. And if that don't please you, the cool with that. Say the ruler's back. I'm a living miracle, street smart, lyrical, driving critics hysterical, living life empirical, risk it all, outcome bound to be terrible. You brag about doing stuff when you accomplished a year ago. Learned a lot like you can't argue with an idiot, it'll drag you to its level, beat you down with experience. Mild man and teacher, peace when I meet ya. Cats think it's sweet, so they ask me, feature. Then ran lazy there, like it's bet. Went from opening hack to cats begging them to head. So did y'all forget the man, well, apparently. Thick glasses, Star Wars sees, yo, there with me. You were whack, stop rapping, you should act. Move them back, like Cairo did to a rap. Never thought I'd see the world, regularly I'm doing that. Konnichiwa, Pax, the roof is back. Hey, I'm talking, see you staring at me. I am who I am, I'll be what I be. If that don't please you, I'm cool with that. Say the ruler's back. Yeah, I hear him talking, see him staring at me. I am who I am, and I'll be what I be. If that don't please you, I'm cool with that. Say the ruler's back. 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 Low classics. I played a game called Castlevania Symphony tonight. I did a whole album about it, so now we're about to go deep into the darkness of Dracula's castle. One, two, three. No whip in my hand, mission in hand, hurting my heart and revenge in the plans. I cover my stance, everything's dark, dagger equipped and it's ever so sharp. Look to the enter to never depart. The most dangerous mission ever depart is in front of my eye. Castle so vast, but to become it and tackle my past. My father is mad, my mother dead. Can't get the memory out of my head. Missing my steps, beat it by death. Who tells me nicely it's best if I left and he don't understand. Mission in hand, easy to repeat and that's why I stand. Do all I can. Dracula's castle is risen again. Check it. Dracula's been resurrected. It's getting all kinds of hectic. And I get knocked out of death. Wish, yes, this one time. Now that this chase on my front line. Got to accept with the blood line. I got to sever the blood line. My father rises, he's put back to rest. Demons are always equipped for the test. Talent, skill, does they possess. But check, but y'all a whole different mess. Here's the good thing if we sick if we peace. These are these showmen, they're back in the sleep. Mission is wounds, but the kids and learn. Dracula's castle, let them return. Here's the good day, they're with the five. Early in bed, early to rise. Here's the good hundred, now he's back in five. Anticipating the hero to rise. Don't understand, mission in hand. Easy to retreat, and that's why I stand. Do all I can. Dracula's castle is risen again, no check. Yeah. Dracula's been resurrected. Yeah. It's getting all kinds of hectic. Getting all kinds of hectic. Yes, this one time 
I take my place on the front line. I got the sever the blood. What? Sever the blood. What? Yeah, somebody in here put a hand in the air. Wave it around and go side to side. Yeah, wave it around and go side to side. Yeah, wave it around and go side to side. Yeah, somebody here put a hand in the air. Wave it on side to side to side. Yeah, wave it on side. Wave it around. Doing my thing. Now we be down. Yes. Ladies and gentlemen, Kay Murdoch. <laughs> Woo. All right. I got to get all the other games that I love out of the way before I get to, you know, the game I love the most, Arkanoid. <laughs> what? It's a great game. Anywho, any role-playing game players around here? Any fans of... Um, Role-playing games, particularly made by a company called Square Enix. I call them Square Soft. I don't call them Square Enix. I'm just saying. But I digress. Um, particularly a game in that came out in 1997 for the PlayStation console. It was not Xenogears, but arguably the greatest uh, role-playing adventure game of all time. I'm talking about Final Fantasy VII. Murdoch and I argue all the time about which one's better. And Give it up for six. He loves six. Yes. I yes. love seven. Yes. We battle. What was it, seven? Or Thank you. That's what I'm talking about. Anywho, seven had the greatest group of insurgents ever to ever blow up a Mako reactor. And you know who the name of that group is, right? Avalanche. Avalanche. They were so badass that I made a song about them. And it's called Avalanche. Would you like to hear it? Here you go. That was weak. Would you like to hear it? Let's go. Now, in order to make this work, we need that up loud, and we need everybody to get ridiculously ridiculous. And the way this is going to work is put a fist in the air, everybody. We need that loud. I need that up loud. I can't. I can barely hear it in my ears. All right. The way to make this thing work is you have to say the word "hey" at the appropriate time. Let's try this. Hey. Hey. Scarlet web is developer who caught me in her tongue. 
While I tried to save my friend died Lost my grip, she shot my hand I thought my friend had died So I kept this thought of a razor as my own child I discovered that I was alive And go keep going till the planet is at peace And if somebody's gotta go That's just a small casualty Keep a high top fade And we keep a bad attitude Pity the fool that compare me to that other dude Avalanche rapping that we pass on Even if I'm gone, Seattle got my back Turn it up, hey! Hey, got a bit nervous, encouraged, got a bit further to go by any means, getting rid of my enemy, A-V-A-L-A-N, I can't hear you, hey, hey, not a bit nervous, no lip service, got a bit further, do what I gotta, who want that problem, A-V-A-L-A-N-C-H-E, that's who we be. That's what I'm talking about. Good job, Pax. I feel like I'm watching a Seahawks game, 12 men. You know Who I mean? knew Final Fantasy could be so crunk, for lack of a better word? Wow. <laughs> Pretty awesome. Okay, so real quick, I'm gonna tell you guys a quick story. Um, I used to be a teacher. Make some noise for teachers. Now, a few years ago, I quit teaching to chase my true love and calling, which was rapping about video games. And now I'm at PAX rapping about video games. Anything can happen, ladies and gentlemen. So don't give up on your dreams. And that brings me to this story. I was uh, making music, sampling my favorite game, Arkanoid, as I told you. No, no, okay. It was Mega Man. Now, I was rapping over Mega Man beats for a long time, and um, that caught the attention of a company called Capcom. Sorry, it never gets old. And when they emailed me, <laughs> I got a little scared. I read the email and it said, hey guy, we heard that you are using our copyrighted material, and you have colored Mega Man black, and, <laughs> and you basically, Disgraced our company. No, they didn't say that part, but this is what I was, the way I was reading it. I'm like, oh my God, here we go. So I scroll down and I'm like, here comes the lawsuit, right? And they said, don't worry, this is not a cease and desist. And I was like, wait, really? And then I scrolled some more and they were like, we wanted to tell you that we at Capcom love it. I was like, excuse me? This has got to be a trick. He's like, no, 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 we love it. And um, in fact, why don't you come on out and we can talk about some things. I'm like, this is definitely a trap. <laughs> a trap. But, you know, I did it anyway. Uh, so I came out, and long story short, I'm very happy to tell you that the re end result of that meeting is that I entered an exclusive licensing agreement with Capcom, which was pretty crazy. So I'm very happy to tell you it gets better. That as of that moment, Mega Ran is officially licensed by Capcom. <laughs> Crazy. So, you know, I went on and I was like, wow, that gives me permission to like steal your guys' stuff, you know? <laughs> cool. So what I did was I went back to the lab and I went back to the old Capcom games and I found a game called Little Nemo the Dream Master. <laughs> nice. You must be old like me. I love it. So we did a track called Dream Master, and it goes like this. Let's do it, Kay. All right, Kay Murdoch made this beat, so we're gonna have some fun with it. Let's do it like this. We're gonna split the crowd down the middle like this, and you guys are gonna say, hey, hey, and you guys are gonna say, all right. We're gonna split it right here. I gotta split you two in half. I'm sorry, you must be dismembered now. No, I'm just kidding. But remember, hey, hey, all right. I'm gonna demonstrate. Here, here we, we go, go Pax. Hey, hey, all right, hey. One, two, 
Once upon a time before beats in the rise, before that was ever really random, there was a boy in the hood who always did good. The bullies on the block couldn't stand him. And on Christmas and birthdays, he got mad presents. So many he didn't know what to play with. He had Transformers, He-Man, Ninja Turtles, Star Wars. The G.I. Joes were his favorite. He was so creative that if they didn't make the toy like he decided to create it, he put Storm Shadow's legs on Snake Eye's body, then he popped. Then he duct taped it. He made spaceships while the big kids hung out on the block, playing hide and seek and riding bikes. Used to try to get involved. They told him, get lost. That's when they started getting high at night. I heard he made a friend that was as nerdy as him. What he had about all he could withstand. He collected comics, cards, and studied. Knew the Star Wars script like the back of his head. And in school, he made A's and B's. Teachers complicated his amazing feats. And all the while, he wondered, if I'm so amazing, geez, why does nobody want to play Come with me? On, he y'all. said, hey, hey, hey. Come on, hey, hey. Yeah, hey, hey, somebody say hey, 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 up top two, hey, hey, come on, hey, hey. So to say this kid looked funny in school, that would be a colossal understatement. He had high water pants, Coke bottle frames, and a mouth full of orthodontic braces. His first girlfriend was named Christina Perez. Took her everywhere, and now the boy is so cool. But she dated him on a dare. Left him standing there with no clue, man. Kids can be so cruel. At the time when they couldn't love him any less. Mama went and going to bought the guy in NES. Cause his mother felt this was the best way to keep him out of the street. Though they were penniless. Only child, she didn't want an empty nuts. And it's a healthier addiction than cigarettes. So it began. How did he escape the scene? He sat in front of that screen and chased his dreams. Pause. Hey, hey, I got you. Hey, hey, come on, hey, hey, come on, hey. All right, say hey, hey, come on, hey, 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 hey. So fast forward a couple years, he gains a couple pairs. Such a game like a vacuum. And then he went off to college and searched for knowledge and developed the heart to make rap tunes. Now to stay true when he dropped his debut and did. It's got his little name up and it was money in the bank. Then he drew a blank every time his second LP came up. So he thought back to childhood. How'd he survive in such a wild hood? But then he realized they didn't hate him. And whatever didn't break him, that's what made him. So he decided to convert. Nice. Ladies Thank and you. gentlemen, Mega Ran. So I decided to make up a fictional story that I thought would get your, <laughs> your tug at your heartstrings a little bit, because that wasn't true at all. No, <laughs> just, just kidding. It was, yeah. But anyway, um, <laughs> so I'm going to have some fun with you guys now. I would like to do something called a freestyle. Yes. Has anybody here ever heard of a freestyle? <laughs> well, allow me to teach. Uh, Freestyle is the art of impromptu rap, meaning that it was not previously rehearsed. And the only way I can prove to you that this was not previously rehearsed is if everyone in here takes out an item, takes something out of your pocket, even up top, I don't know, wherever you are, hold something up in the air. Nothing that'll get you kicked out of packs, please. Nothing that will get you kicked out. Oh, nice. Oh, NC Warrior. Okay. The low classics are back in the place. Yes, give it up. Would you like to give them something, something classic? All right. (laughs) <laughs> Very cool. Okay, I'm gonna do. Wow, this is gonna be epic. If anybody has any type of recording capabilities, you might wanna YouTube this. All right. Wow. All right. All right. Keep your items up. I don't have a very good memory, but let's see. Wow, we got a lot of busters. We got 
phones, 3DSs. All right. Hey, y'all, when I say freestyle, you say freestyle. 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 When I say freestyle, you say freestyle. 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 Yeah. And you know that man, I'm in the jam. And my brother, Brodo Man. Yeah. And when I'm on this thing, you know I do it. Spit mad fluid. And my flow is foolish. Yeah. Here's a glasses. And another one. That's what's cool. I got another one. And I have two on. So I say now, guys. I now have eight eyes, so I'll take these back and hand it to you. Hope I gave you the right one, I'll bring it to you. Yeah, random, see that's me, and I play weak rappers like a PSP. Yeah, I used to like those for emulators, never been a hater or an imitator. Yeah, and you know I keep it live, or he's got the keys, he's the designated driver. When I say freestyle, you say freestyle, freestyle, freestyle. freestyle. When I say freestyle, you say freestyle, freestyle. Freestyle. freestyle, yeah, and you know I bring the right, I like the proto man, I always light up the night, yeah, and I get mad respect, cause after me, the proto men are coming next, yes, and you know I got the for ya, I like the classic Mega Man, not NC Warrior, sorry, I'm not a warrior, but when I come through, I'm like the courier, bring it to you, yeah, it's like a slaughter, now I'm richer, because I got your quarter, in my pocket, <laughs> no it's more than that, I hand it back to you. Now it's a quarterback. Yeah. And you know I got the planet. I go into who they swore with. I can't stand it. Yeah. But a little early on, I had Jimmy John's. And they'll deliver just one sandwich. Yeah. Now I got to say, hey, everybody get packs. Let's wrap in the day. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Wait. How does he have human legs? Yeah. Got again. Again, I already mentioned Proto Man. Yeah. And you know that I be the best. I play rap rappers, just like this DS. And I see another one. Blast me, pass me, even you can street pass me. Yeah, if you play an Animal Crossing. I play that game way too often. Yeah, my name is Mega Ran. I made a town in that game and I call it Mega Land. Yeah, they can't stand me. It's like trying to play a nun in Cards Against Humanity. Yeah, because that's kind of foolish. But I hold this mic, you know I bring it to us. Do this, yeah. You know I got to find it. Buy one of my CDs and I'll sign it. Yeah, you know I got the pass. You can record this and I'll say, hey, that's cool. And you know I got the pass. I hope you not got alcohol in that flask. When I say freestyle, you say freestyle, freestyle, freestyle. When I say freestyle, you say freestyle, 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 yeah. And you know I got to be appealing. One day I like to travel to New Zealand, yeah. And if you know somebody that can book me, call them, and then I won't hook me, yeah. And you know I do my thing. They put an orange tag around this, in case we didn't know that this was real. Cause it's not, but I rap on the spot. No my god, shot, yeah. And you know they can't trust me. Oh, this is a Pokemon, I thought it was a ducky. Yeah, and then they can't trust me. When I'm on this microphone, they all disgust me. Yeah, and you know I got to say this hand here. This is a first aid kit. Yeah, and I gotta save it private for a second. I'm gonna see what's inside it. Hope this doesn't embarrass you. The fact that you're saying no makes me wanna do it more. Oh shoot, I know what he's using it for. Yeah, so I'm gonna hand this back to you. When I rap on the sand, I'm gonna back to you. Yeah, I get you open like a door hinge. Trying to fool me, giving me an orange. I know how to rhyme that. I rhyme around the block. And you know I do it all the time, Jack. Yeah, why well, play? Hi, hey, make a ramble, get busy on a Friday. When I say freestyle, you say freestyle, freestyle, freestyle. When I say freestyle, you say freestyle, freestyle, freestyle. Low classics, keep the beat on going. Gotta keep it bumping, and you know we keep them open. And so, one more thing before I go. My name's Mega Ram, that's a freestyle flow. Peace. Player two. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Okay, I don't have the time. I haven't even done anything Mega Man related. Okay, guys, we gotta stop. Yeah. Bam. Give it up for the low classics one time. Is anybody here slightly immature?
This is the song for you. This is a song called Grow Up, and it utilizes the Woodman theme of Mega Man 2. It's a very simple chorus. I need you to help me with it. I'm going to say, I just can't seem to grow up. Said, I just can't seem to grow up. But you know what? And you need to respond with, what? And you know what? What? And you know what? What? I'll tell you. you know what? Let's do it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. You can even clap a little bit. I just can't seem to grow up. I said, I just can't seem to grow up. But you know what? I don't think I want to. One more time. Here we go. Just can't seem to grow up. I said, I just can't seem to grow up. But you know what? I don't think I want to. Yeah. OK, OK, OK. I was a youngster, maybe seven or eight. I'll be up late playing games. I was straight. Baby said I'm on the couch. Now to get a freak on. Passing level at the level. Thinking I'm a be pong. Little did I know they didn't have any endings. Every couple of levels went back to the beginning. Hard lessons to learn. I recovered fine. Then beat pitfall. Got tired of trying. The NES came around. I had to get down. You didn't like it on my block. You're bound to get clown. My game, Super Mario. I played it to death. First to get a hundred men picking turtles on a step. Learned that from Game Pro, but it's a shame though. Nowadays, video games ain't the same, bro. Complicated, they're not worth the price. No, some, they're a lot like life. And that's why I just can't seem to grow up. Said, I just can't seem to grow up. But you know what? I don't think I want to. One more time, let's go. Just can't seem to grow up. Said, I just can't seem to grow up. But you know what? Sure here. Somebody say, I don't care. I don't care. I don't care. I don't care. Say, I don't care. Say, I don't care. I know you are, but what am I? I know you are, but what am I? I just can't seem to grow up. Just, I just can't seem to grow up, nerd. You know what? What? I don't think I want to. Yeah. One more time. I just can't seem to grow up. Said, I just can't seem to grow up. But you know what? Uh, I don't think I want to. Yo, yo, I beat every game in front of me. My people's wanted none of me. Ran skills and video games that couldn't front. Mom knew how to punish me. Take away the cord. Go to use the AC adapter from my keyboard. I knew that that was something amazing. My boys got in trouble. I was cool. I stayed in. Last street kid. I'm alone like Macaulay. 20 years later, still hosting land parties. Just can't see. That I just can't seem to grow up But you know what? I don't think I want to Yeah, bring it down, y'all I just can't seem to grow up Said I just can't seem to grow up But you know what? I don't think I want to Ooh. Keep clapping, keep clapping your hands And come on Keep clapping, keep clapping your hands And come on Keep clapping and clapping your hands And come on I clap in your hands, I said I just can't seem to grow up Said I just can't seem to grow up But you know what? I don't think I want to Ooh, -hoo. yeah, yeah, yeah Low Classics, K Murdoch, what's up? Good one, good one, well played, sir. All right, let's keep the Mega Man goodness going here. Um, arguably the greatest or most popular theme in Mega Man 2 is um, the one from the theme of this evil genius who is um, the final boss character in the game Mega Man, which is who? Dr. Wally. Now, I always wondered if Dr. Wally could explain himself, because I never really knew why this guy was so crazy. Um, and if I sat him down in the chair and I said, Dr. Wiley, please explain yourself. I feel like he would say, Vel, and then I would stop him and I'd be like, no, 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 no. Explain yourself in the form of a rap song. <laughs> and then that would be this song called Wiley. Let's do it, y'all. Mega 
that man changed your life like it did for mine. Make some noise. Woo! One of the smartest in the world. Amazing advancements in the field of robotics. Money was no object, but he never felt the need to make a profit with projects. He had a best friend, Dr. Light, that could have changed the world if they had stayed together. But they cop this turn a bit of rivalry, and one day it changed forever. While he started coming up, felt like it was second place. He was always runner up. He got sick of second place. Felt like it was while he started to start coming up. The school held a contest, showing off technology and charting the progress. While he and Light collaborated, but Light got all the accolades. My press, I guess. Molly had enough for that, started acting up, back to stuff, that was tough, we weren't buying it, that was the beginning of a mad scientist, who might win some, but he just lost one, they were for one, that's not fun, that the robot didn't have son, so we named the robot and called his son, Rock, named for his love for music, lab assistant, that's his toolkit, teenage boy, clumsy, clueless, always amusing, that was the blueprint, they didn't want Rock to be all alone, he but another robot named Roll, life was grand, little did he know, Molly was coming back now, Help me out, say Dr. Wally, Dr. Dr. Say Dr. Wally. Dr. Wally, say Dr. Wally, Dr. Wally. say Dr. Wally. Dr. Wally, yeah, I'm taking over, nothing can stop me, Dr. Wally, do not try me, it's Dr. Wally, once again, say Dr. Wally, Dr. Wally, Dr. Wally. Dr. Wally. say Dr. Wally. Dr. Wally, say Dr. Wally. Dr. Wally, yeah, I'm taking over, nothing can stop me, Dr. Wally, Try me, it's not quality, do not try me. All was well in the city of robot. Peace and love, no shots, no cops. Guess who comes back to the block? Danger comes, it's likely it won't knock. And it laughed like a repo man. Left on this robot's reprogram. Air man, crash man, metal man, guts man, but don't you you can keep those man. That just like the retos man. Little huge fortress and leash those plans. Robots stay back that town. If you wanna stop them, you gotta bow down. And now a worse fears came to light. Worse, everybody's blaming light. Doc has one robot left that's rocking. That kid isn't even trained to fight. World domination, he's hell bent. Though he puts on a blue suit and helmet. Tells Rock, don't kill if you can help it. Can't believe his old friend's so selfish. Mad destruction is only objective. Only yet, no one respect it. But the blessed is just to protest it, but it's not your matter of perspective. Can't let him win this fight. Time to could equip, bots get sliced. Doc has Wally in his sights. Can't blame yourself, they in his life. So they lock the doc in the cage when they think of spend the rest of his days. But I heard the other day he escaped and I bet he's coming back. So somebody say Dr. Wally. Say Dr. Wally. Say Dr. Wally. Say Dr. Wally. Yeah, I'm taking over. Nothing can stop me. Doc Wally, now twist your finger up and make a W like this. And put it up and say, Dr. Wally! Dr. Wally! Say, Dr. Wally! Say, Dr. Wally! Yeah, I'm taking over. Nothing can stop me. Doc Wally, do not try me. It's Doc Wally, do not try me. Oh, 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 Try me, do not quietly, do not try me, huh? Nice. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna ask you a weird question. Is there anyone here who can probably identify themselves as a nerd? Okay, so we're a little bit of like, nerds! I just asked you that so I could judge you, nerds! No, I'm just kidding. Um, I, I wrote this song, this next song, after experiencing some things when I was like, wow, man, it's so cool that you can be a nerd and everything about nerd culture is everywhere now. Like, it's so cool. You can't go anywhere without seeing, like, nerdy stuff. And I'm like, this is great, man. But um, me, when I was young, it wasn't so cool to like the things I was into. I was drawing, I was reading comics, I was doing a lot of things that were considered to be lame. And I got a lot of flack for that. And um, did anybody here get flack for liking things that they liked? Okay, so good. You can relate in this song. So this joint here is called You Didn't Know. And now you know. So let's do it. And um, the track is from one of my favorite role-playing games, uh, a joint called Illusion of Gaia. And cool, cool, the earth and the womb theme. And um, so yeah, this joint here is Now You Know. Now You Know. Oh, oh, yeah. You didn't know, 
It's cool to be a nerd, chic to be a geek, and it's sweet to be a freak. But if you've never been teased for something that you believe, then you can't relate to me. Said it's cool to be a nerd, chic to be a geek, and it's sweet to be a freak. But if you've never been teased for something that you believe, you can't relate. Last week I went into Macy's, saw a retro shirt section, and thought this is crazy. Transformers and Alpha them sitting right next to Ralph Lauren kind of tripped me out. Then I recognized it isn't how it used to be. I'm happy truthfully, because now the youth can be whoever they choose to be without fear of mistreatment or judgment by their peers. Yeah, now the glasses that I'll be called a geek for in the boutique store they want a G for. Got me on a defensive like a 3 4. I should be celebrating. I guess we scored. But they're calling us retro because we thought the past was the best and we don't want to let go but no matter what i just know exactly where i came from so we'll never forget yo yo it's cool to be a nerd chic to be a geek and it's sweet to be a freak but if you've never been teased for something that you believe you can't relate you didn't know it's cool to be a nerd chic to be a geek sweet to be a freak but if you've never been teased for something that you believe you can't relate to me to, to me to who to me or to you, or, or to me, or to you, or, or to me. Yeah, it's for you. Maybe you were socially impaired. Maybe you talked a little slowly or you stared. Developed a fixation on the things for which you cared. Didn't have the nicest body or the newest gear. Wore braces that had nappy hair. I don't just relate to it, I was there. That was crazy because they look at me funny because I quit the job and expect music to make some money. And now because he profits off talent, the box that you keep him in is falling off balance. Facebook comments telling them keep it real. They cook ramen, he's won a decent meal. Just remember who wasn't afraid to embrace his ways and it wasn't to get paid. Nah, it wasn't for critical acclaim. If no one ever liked it, I'd still do the same. Keep retro tees in my closet, but now when I'm out, 20 people recognize it. It's way too big to stop it. I rep my environment. I'll never be a product. Cause we the sacrificial lambs. Kids today, they'll never understand. So that's why I make these jams. Seattle, let me see your hands. You didn't know? It's cool to be a nerd. It's chic to be a geek. And it's sweet to be a freak. But if you've never been teased for something that you believe, you can't relate to me. Said it's cool to be a nerd. Chic to be a geek. It's sweet to be a freak, but if you never been teased for something that you believe, you can't relate to me, to, to me, <laughs> to me, or, or to him, or, or to him, or, or to you, or, or to you, or you, or you, or you, or you, you didn't know, well, now you know. Does anybody like a show called The Big Bang Theory? Anybody into that show? I hate that show. Sorry. I'd love to discuss that with you later, how they're, they're using you and, and taking advantage of you. But for another time. But for now, if you didn't know, well, now you know. Oh, yeah. Now you know. Yeah, and now you know. Now you know. Now you know. Thank you. All right, I got time for one more. Is anybody here in love or in like at the moment? Yeah? Ah, nice, nice, nice. Okay, I was in like with a very beautiful woman. Um, uh, she was a video game character. <laughs> what, why are you judging me? That's where the problem starts. Um, that was just the beginning of my problems. Her name was Splash Woman. And, oh, you heard of her? She's just pretty hot. But um, we, had, we had some very difficult decisions to make because we had three fundamental differences. Number one, she was a robot. I'm not really into the whole robot on human thing, so couldn't do it. Second, she lived underwater. And I was between jobs. I couldn't afford scuba gear at the moment, so it was, you know, it was weird. Lastly, I found out that she was programmed for the sole purpose of destroying me. Now. If you've ever dated anyone whose sole purpose in life was to destroy you, <laughs> then you know it's probably gonna be a rough one. So, <laughs> unfortunately, I had to kill her. I know, this is where the story gets sad. But however, if you have a mega buster that you got from Capcom, please put it on. 
And at, at, at a very key moment in this song, I'm going to need you to hold it up because this is the story of Splash Woman. Let's do it, y'all. Again, my name is Mega Rand. Thank you all. Make sure you're like, if you're enjoying yourself, make some noise. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now, it takes place underwater, so what I'm going to need you to do is, everybody, put a hand up. Yeah, 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 man, yeah. Somebody here, make a wave like this. Yeah, make a wave like that. Yeah, make a wave, make a wave. But only do that for the chorus, yeah. This is a mission, not a small time thing. Got me on the case like I'm Sherlock. Home was my dome, got a messed up from what I've been seeing, what I've been hearing. Got me not knowing what to believe in. Reason, battling bosses, record is flawless, zero losses. I came across this stunning young piece who resided at the bottom of the sea. And she told me her name was Splash Woman, beautiful but deadly. She was mad cunning, a voice that would soothe the savage. Beast, physique, way above average. Magic, the way she got me in a spell. Got me on lockdown, sort of like a cell. But I'm on a mission and I can't afford a bell. Cause girl, I got a secret to tell. Become don't ever say this, don't ever say this, you're my favorite. Got a tip recently, so we come back to my play with. Got a know my favorite, won't you be my baby? Maybe we ain't gonna buy this land. And we get a bike somewhere, my dear. And even though she knew the truth about Rand, had a feeling she would understand. Now lift up your hand. Thought I was in love before, but I love you more. Baby, come aboard and go away with me. I can make you see what you mean to me, and we can be. Every couple years I get that feeling, feeling like I'm about to hit that ceiling. I can't cause it's lined with spikes and when I reached the lair and it was time to fight, I couldn't do it. Pumped out like Ashton's victim, started singing, I had to listen. It was lovely when she sang, the fish came and all of a sudden the mission changed. Insane, told me about a true purpose, you the same victims that fell through the surface. A few days ago the contract expired, she was scheduled to be thrown into the fire. While he gave her a reason to live, and now she gotta do what he says. He shared a tear, he said, she don't understand. Gotta stick to the plan, I owe everything to this man. It seems to be back to stay me. Gotta sing your shades if we try to convey me. My heart sunk slow, the land door closed. Through the mega bus and that was time to roll. Put him up, thought I was in love before. Love you more, so baby, come aboard and go away with me. I can make you see what you mean to me. We can be free. It's time for battle. Oh, oh. The battle was on and it was fierce. She hit me in her side and left her armor pierced. And on a command, the fish attacked me. Got the mega buster, hit him exactly. But the battle took a turn that was odd. Every time I fired a shot, she didn't dodge. Took each blast from my yard cannon and smiled at me as every shot was landing. Thought I could take sex for standing. Suddenly I started understanding. And yeah, but this is letting me win. Giving me what I need so I can get to the end. By the 17th hit, she began to stagger. Fell to the ground, so I ran and grabbed her. Looked her in her eyes, she tried to laugh. Pulled me close and handed me her step. Said I wish it didn't have to be like this. Thinking he might miss, and she beat my miss. Then don't be foolish, you gotta do this. Let the whole city know what the truth is. And boy, you got stuff to do. Girl, I would've gave it all up for you. I feel invincible when I'm holding you. Far as love goes, I'm open to put them up. Thought I was in love before, but I love you more. Come aboard and come away with me. Make you see what you mean to me. We can be free. Sing it if you know it. How's it go? Sing it if you know it. Come on, just you. Now when I say splash, you say splash, splash, splash. Now when I say slash, you say slash, slash, slash. Now when I say slash, you say slash, slash, slash. When I say slash, you say slash, slash, slash. Yes. Once again, I am Mega Ran. Thank you so much. Thank you, Pax. Couple quick shout outs. I see MC Front a lot over there. Thank you, MC Front a lot. I saw Adam Warrock. Thank you, Adam Warrock. Ladies and gentlemen, the low classics on the guitar. Alex. On the bass, Evan. Make some noise. LG 
signing stuff and giving out free sweaty hugs. You guys are amazing. One time, make some noise for yourselves for being amazing. 